whenever you are preparing for any of the examination uh, one thing you have to look on to the syllabus is uh, whether it is suitable for you can you complete the syllabus is the syllabus interesting for you and how good you will be with the subjects once you are into okay for some students uh, i'll be talking some sessions will be very difficult especially when it comes to rba grade b examination when you are studying the if you are a non-finance non-economic background student it will be difficult for you to study some of the topics especially with regards to the phase two okay for the rba grade b examination so i am going to talk to you about in very depth what is the most difficult phase and the phase that most of the people fail watch this video till the end and subscribe to the channel and enable the bell icon if you would like to see more related videos also like this video if you like this okay and uh, just wanted to announce you something we have started the descriptive batch the pure descriptive batch of the rb grade b examination for the phase two okay so recruitment uh, the for the uh, sorry the vacancies are available so if you would like to join just contact using the link given on the comment section as well as on the description and all the details will be shared over there okay coming to the grade b examination phase one is a type of elimination stage phase two from here your mark scoring actually begins and the interview the three different phases for the prestigious rba grade b examination are these three phase one phase two and interview coming and talking about the phase one how difficult is the phase one that you should know guys it is none other than the general awareness itself that is going to determine your overall cutoff for the grade b examination for this examination we have sectional cutoff and overall cutoff and purely phase one is one of the most difficult phases 95 percent of the people usually don't cross this stage the phase one okay so some people knowing this focus mainly on to the phase one prepare it very well that they get a good mark for the phase one overall cutoff as well as they will be clearing the sectional cutoffs then coming to the with an overconfident mind that they can have this phase two that is not going to work here if you are good with the phase one and have qualified it with very good mark that ends there okay for phase two it is entirely difficult and where most of the aspirants go with it is descriptive paper itself that is why it is important that you should have a very strict knowledge with regards to the descriptive okay so the batch is still going on if you would like to join you can uh, have it and uh, descriptive how you have to deal with quality points is always there that should always be provided the dynamic nature of the write-ups that you are providing your typing speed the accuracy of the points you are giving how quality is the statistical information i mean the factual information the statistical data you are providing actually determines your marks for the phase two this is where most of the aspirants go with the phase two if you are not fully prepared fully prepared means it will include the type uh, typing and uh, similar level of uh, pinpointing of just the topic everything with related to it integrating the current affairs with regards to the phase to the topics the essays you are writing that is how you are going to fetch more marks and if you are not practice practiced accordingly sorry you will be eliminated from the phase two then coming to the interview it's a level of uh, how you can answer to the interview board you cannot lie there no that is completely not possible because you will be trapped if you are putting a false statement with the related questions the interviewers will be asking you okay but it is possible to give a diplomatic answer and everything uh, that is actually uh, that, that we will talk about the interview the very later for the your knowledge i have shared up to this but interview i think just like about 10 or 15 hours your interview can be full was with just like after the phase two it can be done with uh, very well accuracy it can be done entirely up to 100 percentage just like about 10 to 15 hours for the interview okay so just wanted to say you and regarding the notification i have to talk you uh, that's uh, we cannot say like that just prepare and go on 
notification can be out anytime there is no any official information available yet now but i have posted the videos of the predictions what will be the exam dates okay so uh, exam days the notification and all so just look on to and uh, that's all for today we will meet on another video thank you